Hey everybody, I am doing another MechWarrior Online game commentary let's play thing. And uh, this time, I'm bringing out one, one mech uh, that you've actually seen, but it has a slightly different loadout. Uh, remember that Gospel I had? Well, now I'm doing uh, my quad PPC uh, loadout, which is actually fun. Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems. Now. I love the startup. Anyways, um, I have equipped ER PPCs. I usually would. I usually used to play this with uh, regular PPCs, but uh, they've recently updated the ER PPCs so they're actually viable. Don't overheat you that much. They do. They are worse than normal PPCs for heat, but uh, I prefer the sniping uh, over the the heat. And and yeah, I, I find that it's it's comparable. Like here, I'm gonna I'm gonna use my alpha right now. And it's about 65. This is a pretty hot map, and this is how uh, fast it goes down. They've also included uh, coolants, which is a consumable item, which not everybody was too ecstatic about. Uh, but, you know, whatever. And I have a 280 engine, which is not, not too shabby. I, I actually like this one. Uh, I could go pretty fast. I'm faster than most of this team. Um, you know, better, better than most assaults. And I have basically, on my left click, I have my left uh, PPCs and my right click, my right PPCs. And three is just my arm ones because uh, in case I need to aim up high, uh, I have that possibility of doing that. Target acquired. Let's see. Now, this is one hell of an alpha strike. Like, seriously, oh, I see you. It's 40 damage, and it, it requires, like, it's basically 10 more damage than the Goss Pult you saw me do, working with. And this one is on infinite ammo. I'm only Target limited by my heat, and that, that, that degrades my rate of fire, but in the end, it's actually probably a Warning. much, Incoming much better missile. option. What the hell? Someone fired two missiles at me? I'm insulted. Alright, so nobody's here. So, uh, usually uh, the way I play this one is, um... The ER PPCs, unlike the regular PPCs, have no minimum range, so I can use them at point blank if I want to. Uh, I don't usually want to do Target that, uh, but if if the time comes for it, then I can do that. And I'm going to turn my torso so that he has to hit my arm if he wants to return fire. And so basically, I, I'm I'm basically a sniper mech, and I have 810 meters uh, of of optimal range and 1600 meters of of maximum range which will do reduced damage with so you can hit this guy I, I need to be very careful with my aim that guy have to that guy has to kind of aim into the uh oh someone's flanking with LRMs luckily that looks like that guy's going for it. I'm gonna just go beyond this hill over here so that I have better cover uh, that's what you want as an energy sniper you want some nice cover uh, cover cover is nice but um I, I love this I love this play style it, it it appeals to me in every way uh, because it's 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 basically four giant fucking rail guns on a, on a mech uh, is the best the best way I can describe it and I'm, I'm running into this wall here um, but yeah, you need to be conservative with those shots. Don't, uh, uh, like, go duck back into cover to cool down and things like that. Don't like, it's basically, quiet. I have tried a variation of the Stalker with, with six PPCs, and I just don't like the speed. And let's aim ahead a little bit. Oh, wait. And I hit that guy in the arms and the, in the, uh oh. Okay, good. I hit that guy, um, what's we call it? Sorry, I tried a variation of the Stalker, which can uh, carry six PPCs, and I did not like it. Uh, I found it to be too slow and really bad. What the hell is this catapult doing? Bye. <laughs> I have red torso, I'm the best. And he just runs after me. Okay, is this guy vulnerable anywhere? Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna hit him in the back. And there goes his back armor. And that this is the, this is the be definite benefit of this mech is I can definitely uh, hit people at close range. That is no longer a vulnerability. People don't run up to me anymore. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to get a shot on that guy. Oh wait, no, maybe I will. I I don't take blind shots. I try and always get a, a decent hit off, and so I just killed that guy's component because you are very vulnerable. 
Now, uh, one of the things you can do is you can over, uh, they've added something where you can override your shutdown so that you'll never, uh, um, you won't shut down if you overheat by override just hitting it, engaged. hitting the o the override key. And this means that for the next like five seconds or something, if I if I fire over my th heat threshold, I will not shut down, which is something I'm just beginning to master because uh, it's really sucks to to have to deal with. Uh, uh, overheating, especially when you don't want it. Because in situations where you do not want to overheat, uh, you need to, you need to, you, well, you don't want to shut down, basically, because you're a sitting duck then. I don't think there's any situation, like, oh, sometimes there's a ER PPC catapult. It's, it's a decent thing, like, you can shut down after it, uh, the, the shot you take, it doesn't matter. If you're, because if you're so far away, it doesn't matter. But if, if it's a case like this, where I'm up close to this guy, I, I'm not going to want to shut down, so I'm going to override my, my shutdown uh, prematurely. And so it, it's really a lot of like uh, mastery and like paying attention and Target making acquired. sure. Override engaged. Okay, I'm going to back off because my heat is too high. This is my honestly one of my favorite playstyles, and I would never play an assault variation to this because I just don't like it. Okay. So th this one I actually went over the threshold and I took a bit of internal component damage and that was bad. Like you can see my head is now in the red but the armor is up. Target so that's acquired. the that's the risk you take. Um, acquired. And both these guys are pretty good off. New target acquired. So this one I'm just going to shut down because I'm so far away I don't care. Okay, uh, I can take that last shot and then... Uh, start back up so you won't take damage if you if you do the shutdown thing but uh, unfortunately right now I'm waiting for my heat to dissipate before I have to start up again okay. which is the one problem about playing an energy sniper mech and and you can just do these things where you just like you shoot him after every every overheat but the minute he's up to you you probably should be more ca courteous and cautious about what you're doing but this is like the well second last guy actually so let's go get into a better. Oh, uh, what's this guy? Oh, it's a cicada. Oh, let's go. Let's go ruin his day. Cicada is honestly, it's one of my new favorite mechs. New target uh, mostly because I, I did a, I recently did a nice little ERPPC build. What the hell is this guy doing? Okay, well, I'll just get him to the cockpit or not. Oh, I didn't even kill him. I don't even know why I'm shooting at him. He's like clearly not even there. Um, and I, I like how I can, I can, you can just fire half of yours off. I used to do this chain fire thing, but I don't really, I don't really go for that anymore because uh, it's useless. I never used it, but I do use like half my PPC sometimes. Okay, didn't get, couldn't find a good shot on that guy, and this guy's kind of in the way. There we go. That's a kill. Well, not from me, but you know, from somebody. Okay, this guy, I gotta wait for him to come over here. Target acquired. I gotta wait for a decent shot. And now. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Looks like the game's over. Alright, well, we'll uh, do another match. Oh, actually, let's go take a look at the score. Honestly, it's, it is my favorite one. Uh, just because of the, the, the pure snipe ability and, and close range. And look at that. 600 damage. That's a winner. That really is. Oh, well. you can also see player stats. This is like the new score screen, so you can see my individual contributions as well, and like like how much experience I earn and whatever. So here we are on one of the new maps. Uh, I'm I'm kind of glad that, that this one loaded up, but I think it's in the queue more often because it's so new. Um, I don't actually have a whole lot of playstyles left to to show you guys because um, I, I I guess I'll talk a bit more about um the limitations of the game currently, and that's um. Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. Sorry, that's like the coolest thing in the world, so I, I just want to always shut up and let you listen to that. Um, so I want to, uh, I'm actually going to follow my team here, so let's go this way. I want to talk a little bit more about the, yeah, so the limitations of the game so far that I'm finding. Um, so I, I honestly I really do enjoy this game and I didn't stop making videos about it just because of the fact that um I, I didn't I stopped like I got burnt out on it. It's just because I I have like 
all the play styles I'd want, and they need, really need to add some new weapons because every everything else I'll show you is like, there is some new interesting stuff with cicadas that I want to show you guys, so uh, I'll definitely be showing you. There's two more for that when I when I master those, and because um, uh, I want to get the pilot specializations, they have a, a little bit of an RPG grinding thing going on. You know, it's not necessary, but it, there is a bit of a heavy grind to this game if you want to be if you have uh, if you want to perfect everything. That's the kind of guy I am. Um, uh, what's one call it? Uh, so this is this is actually the hottest map of the game. Sorry, I forgot to mention that. And it's very big. It's it's there's actually another Arctic map which is very large. I, I posted a cicada video on that was uh, informal. That was a stream video, and this is I, I want to actually post like an, uh, some LP footage. But anyways, um, so a lot of my play styles for my mechs are starting to overlap. So there was a mech that came out recently that was called the Jagger mech, which is another heavy, and I've wanted to get another heavy because. Uh, I was thinking of cataphracts because cataphracts are kind of nice, but um, I have a lot of the catapults, and I, the only playstyle I haven't shown you guys is actually LRM playstyle, which I think I will do a video on. Even though I, I uh, for I honestly think LRMs are terrible, and I think I'll go more into that into that video. But um, uh, but like there's nothing with the Jagger mech I could do I I could do that I couldn't already do with my catapult or whatever. So, oh, oh no, don't go into chat. Target acquired. Uh, he's gonna be over here. Is someone taking pot shots at me? You have to be very cautious on this map. I am kind of in in an open area, so I, I probably would want New to. Target acquired. What's? Oh shit! All right, let's let's get the hell out of here. I'm turning my torso away from them. So they have to hit my arms because my arms are like usually the last thing to go. This is unfortunate because I'm a sniping mech and they're coming straight for me. So I need to go find what the hell am I going bumping into? Okay, um, that's an AC twenty, Paul. Don't want to don't want to go near him. But his uh, optimal range is two seventy meters. So if I stay two seventy meters away, if he takes a shot at me, he's wasting his his time. Uh, but unfortunately, I have to get over this hill if I want to take a shot at him. So. Oh. New target acquired. What's this guy got? A t another AC-20, Paul. These guys are gonna wreck us, I can tell you that now. Those, that's a really, acquired. really good build. Oh. Need a good shot. Uh, anyways, um, so, like, I, I do not like any assaults. Um, and I did not like any mediums before I, I did my, uh, before I played around with the cataphract. Okay, I, I, can't, I can't shut down because they're all right behind me. Left torso, critical damage. They took out my back armor. I did not even see them coming behind me. There's no cover here either. I'm, t I'm, I'm right now putting my... I'm, I'm right now on my side here because... Uh, if, if he hits me, he has to hit me in a place which is not optimal for him. Alright, it's Target just me and this guy now. He's got AC-20s though, which is not good for me. Oh, my... Uh, I think I'm dead. That's it. Ugh. They they flanked on me and I died because I I was not paying attention. Well, I can't see what's behind me, so whatever. Uh, I guess I'll talk about the the heavier mechs and stuff a little bit later. But yeah, that's that's how it went down. And we won by cap. Uh, a, a dragon was capping the entire time, so we actually won. Uh, they must have been not too happy about that because they were actually pretty coordinated as a team. So, oh well, interesting. Hey, hey, holy shit, it's Alpine Peaks. I get to show you like all the new maps today. Oh well. This is this is this is one of my actually one of my favorites. And this is a really, really cold map too, so uh good for my PPCs. Even though I don't want to be fighting at close range, which is something I have to be very careful about, unlike the last match. Reactor online. Sensors online. Weapons online. All, All right, uh, so on the subject of uh, 
different mechs, the roles, and why I don't play them. Um, so there's obviously the lights. The lights very fast, scouting mechs. Um, not a lot of hard points on them. Very maneuverable. Uh, I have a Raven 3 I've done a video on it. I don't really like playing it because it's mostly... The, the thing about the lights is they've devolved a lot into how many streaks you have, and I don't like having streak missiles. They're the lock. They're the auto lock on light missiles. And I just don't, I don't really find it fun. Um, and I don't find it fun facing other lights with streaks, so I, I don't really bother. You're, you're very lightly armored, so I, I usually stay away from those. Now, the mediums I've always never really liked, to be honest. And the reason I don't like mediums is, uh... Oh, just barely missed. Uh, the reason I don't like mediums is because they have a really fucked up roll, and I'm having trouble getting over this hill. Um, they're like... I, I don't understand, because I'm looking at my... Okay, my catapult right now is going 76.8. I can make them go up to about 86. Um, the thing, most mediums have similar speeds. Most of them, like Centurions, Hunchbacks, and all that kind of shit. Like, they're just... Like, and, and I ask you why. Why would I ever want to play a medium mech if I, if I could just play it with my catapult and just have similar capabilities? I, I'm PPCing them, you can go goss them, buddy. Okay, and now we're, now we're backing off. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go over this hill. Like, uh, that's the thing, the, the mediums, their hard points are interesting because they get a lot of hard points, so you can put like a lot of like medium lasers on or something, that's kind Target of the point. Acquired. And this guy's standing still, which means I get a free hit off. Uh, he's really far away, so I'm going to be doing reduced damage. Um, so yeah. So anyways, I, I never liked any mediums Acquired. because they always had lower, um, uh, by the way, this is the optimal sniping range for me. Uh, this guy is like with, right within my range. Now we're just gonna hide over here. New target acquired. While my while my heat dissipates, I'm debating going up the mountain even more. Let's go do that. I'm being hit, but that's oh well. I'm not really being hit. They're really inaccurate. Oh no, my laser the laser hit me. New target acquired. Let's hit this guy. New target acquired. Um, so the mediums, I just, I never liked them because of that reason. It's just like, why would I want to play a mech that's slower than my catapults and I can't equip as heavy as weapons? Because, you know, you get a lot of DPS in, but they have less armor. So no armor, no speed, no mic play, basically. You know, um, that's, that's my opinion, that's my opinion on that. That's why I don't like them. Um, target acquired. On the other hand, though, pfft, okay, I'm just not going to head out. Thanks for the warning. Uh, on the other hand, the heavies, though, the heavies, though, can equip a lot of nice little, uh, nice weapons, and they have, like, you know, about 15 or 20 extra tons on them each. So I never touched the mediums, but I've been wanting to get into medium chassis as of late. New target um, and, and it was basically a matter of, uh, I... I was looking at the Jagger mech and I was seeing what kind of builds I could make and I couldn't really make anything I didn't already have that could my catapults could do better. So I basically got a little bit on the uh, I was like fuck I gotta I gotta I gotta play something because all I have are catapults in the Raven. Uh, and I probably wanna get the Cataphract 4X soon. Um, so I'm just like, okay, I, I don't really know what to do in this case. Solid hit. Um, I, I didn't really know what to do, so I, I started playing around with the cicada, and I realized that. Do you, do you remember that? Um, that I did a catapult video for you guys, and I basically um, I, I I did two two PPCs on him, and it was a lot of fun. Like I I, I made it work. And I realized I could do two PPCs on a cicada. I'm like, holy shit! I gotta get cicadas with with with, an e with with the ECM on top of that all. I'm like, that's fucking amazing. And so I was really happy about that. Acquired. I wonder how much damage you're gonna get by the end of this, because I, I don't think I, I'm, I'm constantly out of optimal range. Oh, well, he hit me there. And he's continuing to shoot me, which means probably it's something to do with like, you can see people when you're not supposed to be able to shoot them. Uh, okay. 
I love these hits. I'm getting. Target acquired. Oh, cool. I can hit this guy. Oh, look at this guy. He's like 1,300 meters. I, I think I've been fight, constantly fighting people out of range. Anyways, okay, sorry. Let me continue on my thought. Uh, so heavies, I might get a Cataphract 4X soon, and I think I... Oh, okay, good. I didn't hit my own guy. Um, I might get a Cataphract 4X soon just for, like, the spamming ACs uh, ability that I, I would have. New target acquired. And um, that's that's basically all I think I would want to do. And that's what I mean. A lot of the... Uh, playstyles are starting to overlap, so I want some new weapons in this game, uh, because, you know, I can only really show you things like ER, PPCs, and whatever. Uh, like, uh, there's only so much I can show you. New target acquired. I want to show you more, but I, I simply can't. And, uh, well, like, th like there's some some more interesting playstyles like, I can show, but, you know, it's still a matter of, like, unlimited. Base is being captured. Yeah, I figured that was the case. I'm going to teach them never to cap my base again. But at any rate, um, I'm, I will be showing off uh, some other stuff. And the assaults I just never Wait, play because they're just captured. they're so unmaneuverable. Incoming missile. New target acquired. Okay, let's see this guy. Warning, incoming missile. Fuck, it's an SRM cat. Warning, incoming missile. Base is being captured. Warning, incoming. Uh, we may not win this because. Oh, wait, wait, they're they're trying to fight me now. Warning, incoming missile. New I'm in a horrible spot versus LRMs. There's no cover here, so. Because they, they kind of forced me to. Uh... Fuck. I need to get out of here. Warning, incoming well, I guess I'll go down here. Dying to these guys is probably better than. Uh... Dying to LRM spam. Oh, here's another guy. What the hell is this dragon doing? Oh, I think he lagged out. Oh, well. What's it? Uh, like, everyone's here? Like, I thought we killed most of their team. Uh, I, I, I gotta keep my back torso protected, so I'm gonna be very careful about this. I like the fact I can I can snipe at close range with this guy. I still have a lot of armor in my front. Anyway, so I don't ever play assaults because uh, they're just too slow. I don't like them. Wait, what, what happened to this guy's ACs? Does he not have them anymore? Okay, it's fine. And apparently I hit the. Oh fuck. Where are the missiles coming from? Oh, this guy's got him. I think I can finish this, though. And what, what's this guy trying to... Why? I keep hearing incoming missiles, but nobody's ever doing anything like that. Warning, incoming missile. Level critical. And let me just finish this guy off. What the hell is that? Seriously. Uh this atlas got fuck I'm dead well that was unfortunate I kept missing there why was I the only one alive whatever I guess uh, we'll end it off there um, the assaults are just too slow for me and I, I could never get they don't have any good loadouts or anything so I don't really like them so yeah that's pretty much the end of that and what did I get 664 damage I'm very surprised I wasn't able to actually finish that off it's like I kept missing that one damn catapult. Oh, I'm sad with my railgun skills. Oh, well. Well, that's the end of that. So, hope you enjoyed uh, four peop quad PPC uh, loadout. So, we'll do we'll do some more MechWarrior videos as I uh, unlock some more mechs.
it's still really it's a really fun game. You you guys have to try it. You know, even with the like as I said, it's not a completely limited selection of weapons, but it's still you know they could use some more. So, oh well. Well, later, guys.